parliament is actually looking at the delineation where it already violated the constitution. Uh, it violated the constitution uh, because the delineation didn't follow in terms of one person, one vote, one value. The, the, ignore the local ties. It also ignore the very fact that you know there has to be equal proportion. There is so many discrepancies in which they have allocated landmass versus the uh, population of uh, voters. Mm. Information that you now get in Parliament is not the information that was given to the voters. When they made the objection, they did not make the objection based on this book. Mm. This is a lot more information. The map is even more detailed than what you get when uh, they announce the delineation. And that is a serious violation. But yet, you know, federal court rejected our case and say that the display was enough. But why is it that they can give this much of information now to the parliamentarians and they couldn't do it at the Sarawak level? Uh, the problem with this is that in Baram, you have a large area and a large population. Whereas Igan is small and uh, and the uh, smaller voters, which means that the MP and also the Dun State Assembly in Baram has to cover a much larger area and much larger voters, 31,000 voters as compared to Igan, which is smaller, and the voters' area is only about uh, 8,000. The voters number? 18,000. Yeah. 18,000. They created a small new Dun seat which is the Gedong. Gedong is 632 square kilometer and the voters is 6,700. The other two Dun seats are smaller also. Simunjan is 751 uh, square feet with uh, 323... Uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, the area is 323 3 square feet, a uh, square kilometer, and the voters is about 7,500. The other one is Sadong Jaya, 76 square kilometer with 6,700 voters. So if you add Simunjang, Sadong Jaya, and Gedong, there is no reason why you want to create Gedong because these two parliament, uh, these two state seat actually can already service Batang Sajo. But why they create uh, Gedong, it could be to actually distort the voting pattern. Okay, So you have a very small new state seat and very small voters as compared to other, other uh, state seats that covers like 31,000 large land area. <coughs> There's no logic in terms of the uh, delineation that is uh, done by the SPR. SPR it keeps on repeatedly says that they are for clean and fair elections. This is definitely not clean and fair elections. This is really a distortion. Kita tidak menolak bahawa kita perlukan pertambahan kursi. Tapi cara-cara mana dia telah terjadi dilakukan itu yang menjadi pertikaian kita. Jadi kalau dekat pada kucing tidak ditambah dengan kursi yang lain sebab itu tidak mencerminkan Buat ya undi di mana dalam dalam ramai pengundi pengundi di satu tempat dan di pengalaman yang boleh ditampak kursi pengundi pengundi itu tidak tidak betul ramai tidak setuju dengan menjadi suara rakyat mana yang telah kita lakukan sejak mereka lagi dia panggil apa variance ya variance itu tidak boleh meningkat sekarang ini meningkat mendadak dan hanya ditentukan kepada kawasan-kawasan yang di pendalaman yang selalunya tidak sepatutnya ditambah kursi.